Sagittarius, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali, a.k.a. Awotero, and I'm here to give you guys your weekend reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you guys this weekend, what's coming towards you, overall messages, and possible outcomes. Guys, before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically, and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. If this reading resonates and you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, guys, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. Alrighty, Sagittarius. Let's see, what is the overall energy here for Sagittarius? Messages, please, universe. Archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. What is this Page of Pentacles for my Sagittarius universe? And Queen of Swords. So, Sagittarius, what I'm getting here is that you... Oh, wow. You are turning down offers. You're turning someone's offer down. Someone is coming towards you and they're making you this low ball offer. They're trying to make it seem like it's a very interesting, very um, abundant, very stable offer. But you're turning your back to the situation. You're moving on to bigger and better. This definitely has to do with the relationship here. Two of Cups. For some of you guys, you're in separation with an individual that is wanting to come back towards you. Okay? This may very well be a karmic relationship. Spirit is wanting you to know by you turning down this offer that is going to be the best decision of your life. Six of Cups in the reverse. You're not accepting this person's offer. You're making a decision to move on and move forward towards calmer waters to move towards a different situation some of you guys i heard someone is getting ready to move out and this person's trying to stop you from moving out so they're making these shitty ass offers hope hoping and praying that you would stay and not walk away but you're being told to proceed with you moving forward because this person's offers are just full of crap okay they're not going to be sustainable they're not going to be stable they're just offering you something to keep you stuck with the two of cups in the reverse, this person is not a soulmate. This is actually a karmic soulmate. You continue holding on to this situation and you're going to find yourself in this nine of swords energy. But by you letting go of this connection, you're releasing the nine of swords energy. By you not accepting this past person's offer, you're letting go of the negativity. This decision that you are making, wow, Sagittarius, it is bringing you to a queen of pentacles energy. To a very stable situation for yourself and for your family. Some of you guys may have children with this person. Okay, you're going to be okay if you're scared by you moving away from the connection. You feel like you're not going to have enough to take care of the family, enough to pay certain things or do certain things. Don't you worry, Sagittarius. Everything will be perfectly fine. You're being told to not allow this connection in. Leave it out in the cold. It's not going to serve any purpose for you. Do not move towards the situation because you are dealing with an individual who is very reckless. Okay? Very, very reckless. This person is just making these offers because they want to keep you stuck. They don't want you to move forward and be successful without them because ultimately at the end of the day, by you letting go of this person, you are bringing in victory. You are bringing in success. Okay? By you holding on to this individual... You will not be victorious, okay? So it is time for you to let go of the situation. Allow the victory in and let go of the situation that no longer serves a purpose in your life. You have a relationship coming towards you. Somebody very passionate wanting to come towards you, okay? There's definitely a new beginning here. And this may very well have to do with self-love. By you moving away from this situation, you're creating so much abundance. You're creating so much stability. And you're bringing in a lot of self-love because... Because you are no longer allowing this person to step all over you, to play these mental games with you, to com continuously keep you in this nine of swords energy where you feel stuck, where you feel depressed, where you feel like nothing's ever going to work out. By you letting go of this past person, finally, you're letting go of this non-victorious situation to walk straight into victory, okay? 
dropping these burdens are going to bring in a lot of truth and a lot of clarity for you okay walking away from this depressive energy leaving these five of cups behind leaving this sadness this this negativity behind is opening up the doors to a lot of happiness a lot of clarity a lot of stability a lot of new energy there's i just i was about to say new love so someone's getting ready as you walk away from this situation you're actually walking into the arms of someone new someone that's going to show you all the love all the affection all the attention that you have been hoping for and praying for from this individual if you're scared to move away from this situation because you feel like financially you're not going to be able to handle this on your own spirit wants you to know that you're going to be perfectly fine you closing out this cycle is you bringing in all this happiness all this abundance all this clarity final messages here for my sagittarius universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians page of wands yeah there's a new spark inside of you a new spark to move on a new spark to do things different you're being told to chase that spark chase that energy because what's coming towards you is truth is clarity you're gonna be perfectly fine sagittarius don't you worry nine of pentacles and justice if some of you guys have to take this individual back to court or possibly just to court period for child support or some type of sustenance you're gonna be perfectly fine you're gonna get exactly what you and your children deserve you're going to be in this nine of pentacles energy pre-empress energy financially you're gonna be good emotionally mentally physically you're gonna be good you're just being told to go ahead and take that leap of faith because there is no more forward movement in this situation you're only going to stay stuck in a situation that isn't going anywhere it is time for you to heal yourself and it's time for you to move on and move forward and attempt to balance things out for you for you and for your family because this relationship is an emotionally manipulating situation and it isn't going to lead into anything abundant nor anything happy or stable okay all right guys i hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed please don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if you want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below i'll talk to you soon bye